Hey everyone, welcome back to The Playroom. Today we're diving into the world of Black Myth Wukong, a game that's been making waves for quite some time now. I'm Vicho, and after putting in about 18 to 20 hours, I'm excited to share my impressions. So let's jump right in. Black Myth Wukong comes from Game Science, a studio that has primarily focused on mobile gaming until now. With this ambitious title, they're stepping into the realm of high-end console and PC gaming. What has caught my attention the most is the blend of breathtaking visuals, immersive storytelling, and the rich tapestry of Chinese mythology that the game draws from. After spending some time with it, I'm pleasantly surprised by how engaging the experience has been, despite some hiccups along the way. Now, don't worry, everything you're about to see is from the PC version, and I'm keeping it spoiler-free for all of you who want to dive in fresh. Setting and Narrative At its core, Black Myth Wukong takes inspiration from the classic tale Journey to the West, allowing players to step into the shoes of Sun Wukong, the legendary Monkey King. This journey is anything but ordinary. You'll encounter fierce demons, cunning foes, and a host of mythical beasts. The game features a linear progression with opportunities for exploration and side quests. While it shares some elements with Souls-like games like checkpoints and difficulty spikes, it leans more towards a narrative-driven action adventure, so keep that in mind. Combat System Let's talk about combat, which is one of the game's strong points. It revolves around a simple yet dynamic system that involves light and heavy attacks along with a dodge mechanic to evade enemy strikes. The flow of combat feels fluid, allowing for seamless combos and the satisfaction of executing a perfectly timed dodge opens up opportunities for counterattacks. As you progress, you unlock a range of skills that can be utilized in battle, adding layers of strategy to encounters. Your primary weapon is a mystical staff, which can morph into different forms, each offering unique attack styles. This transformation not only looks cool, but adds variety to your combat approach. I particularly enjoy using the spinning strike, where Wukong twirls the staff, unleashing a flurry of hits that feel incredibly rewarding. It's essential to mix and match your attacks based on the enemy's movements and weaknesses, making every encounter feel fresh. Abilities and special moves. Beyond standard attacks, Wukong has access to a variety of magical abilities that can turn the tide of battle. One of my favorites is the Shadow Clone ability which creates duplicates of yourself that can distract and confuse enemies. Timing is key with these abilities, and using them wisely can give you the upper hand, especially in chaotic skirmishes. There's also a health regeneration spell that becomes crucial during tougher fights, so knowing when to pull out these moves can save you from defeat. Epic Boss Encounters Now let's discuss the boss fights. Each chapter culminates in intense battles that test your skills. The bosses are uniquely designed, each with their own mechanics and attack patterns, making them feel like mini-adventures in themselves. I've faced off against giant serpent-like creatures and massive demon warriors, each offering a different challenge. It's exhilarating to figure out their attack patterns and exploit their weaknesses. Visual Splendor and Performance On the visual front, Black Myth Wukong does not disappoint. The art direction is striking, with vibrant landscapes ranging from ancient temples to lush forests and stark mountains. The level of detail in character animations and environmental design is impressive, showcasing what modern gaming can achieve. However, I did experience a few frame drops and minor graphical glitches during intense scenes, which can be a bit distracting. Just a heads up, as it might impact your experience if you're sensitive to performance issues. Overall impressions. To wrap it all up, Black Myth Wukong is a bold entry into the action adventure genre. It may not fully satisfy those seeking a hardcore Souls like experience, but it offers enough engaging gameplay, captivating visuals, and rich lore to keep you invested. If you're looking for something that blends action with a fantastic narrative rooted in mythology, I'd say give it a shot, but keep an eye out for updates to enhance your experience. So that's my take on Black Myth Wukong. It's an ambitious game with a lot to offer, and I'm curious to see how it evolves. What do you think? Is this a title you're excited about? Share your thoughts in the comments. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button. Your support makes a huge difference for the channel, and I really appreciate it.
I'm Vichio, and I'll catch you in the next one on The Playroom. <laughs>